Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nock. Welcome along to a brand new video. Today we're going to play Once Upon a Time from a CS16. If you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. Without further ado, let's jump into the description. Once Upon a Time is a map containing two easy to medium monopolt puzzles. The first puzzle revolves around a reverse funnel and cube management, the second focuses on a laser. Yes, you read all that correctly, Red. After all this time, I finally published my first monoportal map. I had a lot of fun making this, and rest assured that this will not be the last monoportal map I make. There are many more techniques with monoportals that I want to experiment with in the future, so watch this space. Special thanks to Hugo and Team Spin for helping me with some of the monoportal logic in this map. I should give a shout out to Hugo's excellent guide, which proved to be a valuable resource when creating the map. As always, feedback appreciated. If you have any exploits or unintended solutions, please let me know and I will fix them. ASAP. Let's begin then. Give me that gun. Alright, so this was reverse funnel and cube management, right? Cube. How's funnel? Does not? No. Okay, so we can get up here. That gives us stairs up into this area. That button is for the funnel. Okay, I made a mistake. I see what I need to do already on here. So I need to place my... Oh, I got resistance against the Fizzler. How weird. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to come around here. Fizzle the cube. Oh, well. Oh. Yeah, okay. Knock failed. Let's try that again. For some reason I thought it was a forward funnel. I'm not sure why I thought it was a forward funnel, because that would have no sense at all. Because I wouldn't be, it still wouldn't be able to get it. But, uh, yeah. Alright, let's try that again. Alright, I'm going to pick it up from here. Okay, so then we're going to want a cube swap. Cube swap is the next technique. So, we'll do this. here. Then we will take this cube back. Place it on the button. Then we go back up to this top area. This cube goes on the reverse funnel. Come with me, my... It's a weird dip. It's quite a worrying dip, actually. <laughs> and then... We can recall the cube. Please. Thank you. Okay. Nice puzzle. Okay, I guess... Okay, I, I think I see what's happening there. It's just on a trigger. But uh, it's just to stop you from going back. I don't think it, it's got no precedence in the puzzle whatsoever. Okay, so we need two things here to... Let's make this. What sort of time is this on? Loads of time. Okay. 
Okay, so I have cube. Maybe we're going to do something like this. Let's get through here with the laser. Also gives me a light bridge. So let me think. I go through here, we lose the laser. So what I actually want to do is now take this point that in that direction therefore when I go through that fizzler um, I can still use the laser over here just like that Okay. Then, all I need to do is avoid the laser. Yeah, the laser's already active. I don't know why I, was, I, I thought I had to rush back and shoot the laser again, but no. I really don't. We're done. Alright, a couple of solid monoportal puzzles there, Asiers. Good good work, buddy. Um, one slight thing is um, potentially the laser. Um, maybe turn laser collision off. I know... I mean, I, I don't mind either way, but I know a lot of people like to. And especially we're coming through the portal here. Um, it just makes it that little bit easier for the player to get through. Um, me personally, whether laser collision is on or off, you may have seen, I just tend to jump over lasers anyway. Because it's just what I'm used to from playing portal. But um, yeah, it might be a nice little touch just to turn it off. Just so players can easy, more easily get through that portal surface. Other than that, good stuff. I enjoyed it a lot. Guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any match to play, please leave in the comments or head to my Google form. A link to that's in the description. But until next time, I've been Knock. You've been awesome. See ya.